So this is, um, this is one of the tests uh, that we made, because of course the moment in which you start to have a system like this, uh, you start to apply it, uh, and the first uh, application is among the people that program it. So we started uh, deciding, using it uh, among ourselves, you know, dig, uh, eat your own dog food, and uh, to see if it, w if it works. And one of the problems we had was with the big uh, proposal. Some people from time to time would write um, huge proposals, you know, pages and pages, and, um, and the other people would actually not vote for those proposals, uh, but then they would not vote for anything. They would not uh, click submit to, to the whole votes, uh, to the whole ballot, and the result of this was that it was freezing the whole system. This is uh, what we called uh, the wall of text problem, and we say, uh, should there be a limit, or uh, how should we handle this? And the interesting thing about Wilfredo is that, um, is, uh, that uh, it handles uh, open questions. It handles open questions. So the questions is, uh, is never something like, should we do this? But... Uh, what should we do, or how should we do, uh, how should we do this? And um, so, as you can see, those were all the proposals uh, that were presented on the first uh, generation. There were six people here, there are only four that voted, but there were six people that wrote proposals, and every person wrote multiple ideas, uh, and so you had all those proposals. The, the fact uh, that uh, an arrow go from one person to a proposal means that that person has supported that proposal. The fact that uh, an arrow goes from one proposal to the other means that everybody over here also supported uh, this other proposal. Okay? So, basically, Owen uh, 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 voted for this one, but he also voted for this one, and also Batokia voted for this one. And then uh, you go higher, and uh, you add uh, Wilfredo itself, uh, which uh, came back uh, and, uh, and voted uh, for all those uh, three proposals. The fact that, uh, so this is also the map of domination. You know, this one dominates this one, those dominates this one, this dominates this, and uh, so on. And the fact that two proposals are together, it means that they had exactly the same people voting for it. Mm. Result of this is that the blue one is the Pareto front. So, first generation, this is the Pareto front. And this is the map of the whole discussion. Those are all the proposals. First generation is here, second generation, third generation, fourth generation, and uh, then we found a consensus. And those were some of the proposals at the beginning of uh, the first generation. You know, writing an, ab uh, an abstract uh, shorter proposal uh, appear first uh, in the places in terms of ranking uh, and, uh, and so on. This is the second generation. Uh, there were more people voting, as you can see, and again in blue you have uh, the Pareto front. Now, because of how um, the actual height over here is a proportional to the number of votes that they have received. Okay, so something over here did not receive any vote, this one received one, this one received two, so all those received two, this probably received three or four, yes, three, because this is only one extra, so probably the maximum was something like five votes or something similar. Interestingly, this proposal had more votes than this one, but this one is in the Pareto front and this one is not. And this is the next generation again, and this is the next generation until we reached something that everybody liked. Okay? And you want to see the solution, I suppose, and this is the solution. Notice that is something that has an abstract itself. I mean, uh, that was just a block of text. We did not require it to have an abstract. But uh, the suggestion is to have an abstract, and it actually applied the suggestion to itself. 
and then uh, it uh, it suggests uh, something more complex. You know, there was a limit of a, a thousand characters, and if you go beyond this thousand, char so th the abstract is only needed if you if you write more than a thousand characters. But and then uh, there are various elements inside. So it's a very complex uh, proposal. Something which would not appear on the first generation. It really needed uh, some digestion from the community to create uh, this, kind of, uh, this kind of ideas. Uh, 